One point if you guess the series correctly, two points if you get the exact game correct, and three points if you get the exact song correct. Let's go. This song means a lot to me and perfectly encapsulates why I love the OST this game is from. It's nostalgic feeling, exciting, cautious, and more all in one. And the game is from a severely underrated with little discourse. Okay, I might not get this, but let's see if it's a good song to listen to. Oh. Dude, Loki, I immediately had Donkey Kong Country vibes again. But if it doesn't get many discourse, feels like Donkey Kong Country. Like, it's like if Donkey Kong Country was an indie game. You know what I'm saying? Dude, what? I'm a rock ukulele in the impossible lair. I feel like it's a Donkey Kong Country clone in a way. What are we rolling with? Okay, uh, not that. It is Bug Fables. Though I haven't played this game yet, I've seen videos and it's probably my favorite game from this series. And this one returns in all three mainline games and this is a remix of it one of the best five themes from the entire series okay quite a few hints there let's see if i can get it oh okay oh this has to be splatoon oh this has there's only three main splatoon games okay hang on this has, hang on okay what are, are we thinking splatoon 2 oh what's the what, what should the name it's a remix it's got to be like the smash ultimate remix of Splatoon 2. I don't know any of the maps from that game though, so I'm just gonna go with the final boss team as default. No, it is actually Dagon Ronpa version three. This song is one of my favorite songs to listen to from this game. It represents one of the climactic moments of the game I chose. I really like how it shifts between bombastic and light at different points in the song. I also love the story that happens around this point in the game. All right, a lot's to uncover here. Let's see if I can get it. We're feeling Kirby. Bro, I, I got no clue. Weird. Is this like a Castlevania game? Could be. Oh, I got nothing. Oh, what if this is, what if this is, um, I'm going Professor Layton. I don't know any of the name of the Professor Layton game, but I'm going Professor Layton. What do we got? No, it is called Sly 2. There's a game called Sly 2 on the PlayStation 2? Are you serious? Well, since I gave you a Toho song last time, I thought I'd be more lenient. So have my favorite song from arguably the most underrated Mario game to date. That's an automatic one point because it's a Mario game. You don't got to reveal the franchise like that. But still, let's give it a listen. See if I can get the exact song. Oh, you got to be kidding me. This is a Mario game? I swear, it could be a Paper Mario game. It could be Paper Mario. Ah, uh, what could it be? Bro, I, I, I got no idea. Uh, this is from a Mario game? Oh, you gotta be kidding me, man. Is this Super Mario RPG? Dude, I'm gonna go Mario RPG. Why not? Let's give it a shot. Oh, I've never played this game. Mario and Rabbids Sparks of Hope. How did I not think of the Mario and Rabbids games? simple i've never played either either of them so those have never crossed my mind wow i loved this song when i first heard it and it was amazing well this might be my first time hearing it so let's see if i can guess it mm. okay oh no i've heard this before shoot where's it from Ugh. where's this from i feel like this is recent this is a relatively recent song i'm trying it everything in my power to guess this one correctly i can't I, uh, I can't figure it out i might have to go with the sonic game i think this might be i'm going sonic superstars i don't know i don't know what's the song oh it's sonic colors okay i'll give myself a point for the franchise it was sonic sonic Colors, aquarium park okay this is a music that i discovered really recently and completely randomly but what a discovery i think it's a really epic music worth listening to sparky let's hope i can get this one right Okay. Oh, there ain't no way I'm getting this one. Yo, hang on. Hang on. Low key. Low key. Is this from Astro Chain? Could be. I'm sticking with it. I'm going Astro Chain. It seems like a platinum game, like one of those heavy action. Or it could be like Devil May Cry, maybe. I'm sticking with the Astro Chain, but it could be Devil May Cry. One of like the metallic boss themes. Like, let's see it. Let's see it. What is it? Oh, my. Oh, I was close. I was close. It's Metal Gear Rising. Oh, yo. Okay. Like, same. Like, almost action RPG style. Okay, yeah, this goes hard. Hey, this is a game that you have played. It is very calm and peaceful. So here you go. Here I go. Let's listen to it and see if I can figure it out. I've played this one. Is this Pikmin? This has to be. 
Is this like the, oh, is this maybe like the save file menu from like Pikmin 4 maybe? I think I'm going to run it with that one. It doesn't sound like Pikmin. It sounds more Mario, but I'm going to go with Pikmin. What do we got here? Oh, it is Pikmin 4. That's incredible. Oh, it's, it's Shireen Shores. Okay, I'll give myself two points for the, for the game. No, I didn't really pick Pikmin 4, did I? I'm giving myself two points. Screw it. It's my game, my video, my rules. This is the best song from N64. All right, well, at least I know it's from the N64. That kind of narrows some of it down, but let's see what the best song is in your opinion. Oh, let's go. Oh yeah, I might have to agree. This is the DK rap from Donkey Kong 64. Easy three points right there. Thank you, thank you for this one. Might stump you. IDK, not sure if it will, LOL. Oh, I've heard this before, I think. Oh, oh, this is a Pikmin boss theme. Pikmin boss theme. Uh, this has to be, I am I think this is Disco Long Legs, right? From Pikmin 4, I'm pretty sure. I think this is Disco Long, yeah, it's gotta be, right? All right, give it to me, give it to me, give it to me. Pikmin 4, that's what I meant, that's what I meant, yep. Oh, easy, three points. I got it, let's go. Just a great track overall. Can I get this one? Let's find out. Whoa, okay. Raceway theme, Mario Kart 64. Oh, that was super, super quick, super easy. Thank you, thank you for this one. Three points right there. Raceway theme, Mario Kart 64. Easy. Hey, 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 yo, hold up. Okay. N64 Mario Raceway from Mario Kart Wii. The two songs are like the exact same. I'm giving myself the three points. I don't care that you got this one from Mario Kart Wii. This is from Mario Kart 64. Three points for me. I got this one right. A great song from a great indie game perfectly builds tension as you go through the level and the timer kicks down. Okay. Mm. Oh, yo, this could be Cuphead. What do we What do we think? Oh, is this Cuphead? No, wait, but it has a timer. Cuphead does, Cuphead does not have a timer. Uh, mm. Oh, but it sounds just like it though. Okay, hang on, hang on. Can I can I think of any others? I don't think this is like Undertale. This ain't Undertale. It's a little bit more pompous than that. Oh, I actually have no idea. I'm gonna guess Undertale because I actually have no idea. Let's see, what do we got here? Mm. Oh, it's a Hat in Time. I did throw that name out once. Wow, I would not. I, I guess that makes sense. The game is called a Hat in Time. There's a timer. Okay, yeah, I get, it. I get, it. I get it. Okay. One word hint, Mr. Beast. All right, let's see what it is. No idea what this could be. It's like I wonder if this is—is is this like Stumble Guys? Because this is like the uh, the game that he always advertises. I'm gonna go with that. Let's see. What is it? What is it? Oh, whoa. Okay, so the Mr. Beast hint literally meant nothing. It was a uh, Delta Rune. This music is very catchy and definitely one of the best music in the game. Okay, let me see if I can figure this one out. Oh. Dude, the file select screen on Mario Kart Wii? Absolutely, that's such an easy one. Oh, dude, this is almost nostalgic for me. Okay, yeah, yeah, we take that, we take that. Or the options menu, whatever you wanna call it. Here's a song from my favorite video game of all time. All right, let's see if I can guess your favorite video game of all time. I have no idea what this could be. Let's let it play out. Uh, okay. Is this a Legend of Zelda game? Maybe this is Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. Let's say it. Oh, Pokemon Conquest. Never would have thought about that one. I didn't even know this game existed. What? Wow. I picked this track because it's from an underrated game that deserves more attention. Okay, I might not get this one then, but I'm down to give it a listen. No, I'm not getting this. Nope, but woo, sounds good. Okay, very. Synthy. I have no idea. I really don't know what it could be. I'm going Astral Chain again. It could be. Let's see. Oh, another Sonic Chronicles. Dude, I thought Metallic, I thought we were going for another Platinum Games type game, but no. This is Sonic Chronicles again. I picked this song because it's one of the most peaceful sounding music from this game. Okay. I have no idea what this is. Seems very, okay, it's chip -toony. I'm gonna go Celeste. Is this Celeste? I feel like it could be. It's very chip -toony. 
guys, guys, it's the same game. How is this Sonic Chronicles game keep showing up? Do I have to play this or something? Like, is this that good of a game? Oh my Lord. I don't really like this game myself, but I do like this song a lot. And it's not impossible to guess, but hard enough. Okay, I might not get this one, but I'm starting to give this one a shot. Oh. Okay. Qui choir going on in the background a little bit. Very interesting. Break it down, break it down. This has to be Castlevania. Oh, I hear those organs. Hang on. I think this has to be Castlevania Symphony of the Night. Let's run it. Mm. Oh, it's Hollow Knight. Oh, I've never played Hollow Knight. Oh, I, I got to play Hollow Knight one of these days. Wow. I chose this one because I think it's an underrated game and it has incredible original soundtrack. All right. Bro, I don't know what to expect. Bro, why does this sound like Super Nintendo? Oh, is this like Dragon Quest? Hang on, I might go Dragon Quest. I don't know why it popped in my mind. Like Dragon Quest 3. Let's see. Come on now. Uh, FNAF World. Okay. I, 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 that's, that's not what I was expecting at all. This soundtrack is heard a lot throughout the game, so they made sure it sounds really good and they did not disappoint. Okay, well, if it's a game I played, maybe I'll recognize the song. Let's give it a shot. Oh, I have heard of this. Why? Why does this sound like Mario? Okay, this is Mario, but like what Mario game is this? Oh my Lord. Oh boy. Oh, oh. Mario. Oh, is this the Mario Party 10 like menu theme or intro theme or main theme? I'm just gonna say main theme. Make it broad. Mario Party 10, please. Ah! Oh. I got one point for the franchise, but no. Why did I think it was 10? Super Mario Party. That makes so much sense now. Ah! Oh. All right, the man, the myth, the legend. Jesse says, stumbling upon this as a kid when messing around in the PS1 system menu surprised me because it is only accessible if you try to play the game as an audio disc and cannot be found in the game alone. Fond memories of me trying to play it anyways. That is a deep cut and I like it. I'm not going to get it, but it's going to be cool to listen to it at least. As you can see, this is a PlayStation black disc. What? Cut number one contains computer data, so please don't play it. <laughs> but you probably won't listen to me anyway. Whoa. Will you? That is hard. What a hard intro. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Okay, th this is sick. This might be my favorite. This might be my favorite of all the songs we've listened to so far. Oh, the synths go crazy. I don't even know where I think this could be. Dude, give me Soul Calibur 1. Like, Soul Calibur 1, uh, like, debug menu or something. Give it to me. Oh, it's Castlevania Symphony of the Night. I guessed this a couple turns ago. PS1 bonus track. Oh, wow. I chose this song because I have very vivid memories playing this game. I would act, I would be so surprised if I get this song right. Honestly, a banger from a very obscure game. Oh, I'm not getting it then. I will give you a few hints. It was released on the PSP and the DS and was developed by Konami. It is in a series with the first game releasing in 1981. Yeah, that ain't gonna help me, but I appreciate you giving the hints at least. Okay. The heck kind of game what was released in 1981? Yo, what? Oh, I was going to go with Galaga. Yo, it could be Galaga. Yo, what if low key we rock in Galaga like Dimensions? But I feel like Galaga was like 79 and not 81. Or maybe I'm thinking Space Invaders. Maybe. Oh. Yeah, we're going Galaga Dimensions. Let's see how it goes. Hey, yo, Frogger. I didn't realize Frogger. What? Whoa, Frogger. Okay. I mean, do I really need to explain best music of its series? So good that the best part of it is used in other themes in the same game and in other games as well. Oh. I mean, come on, come on now. Gusty Garden Galaxy from Super Mario Galaxy. You think I wouldn't know this one? I appreciate you putting this one on here. It's kind of incredible. Yeah, it's it's just a vibe. It's a vibe. Love the three points. Woo. I chose this song because it's from a game I really love a lot. And the song is really fire. If you ask me, one of my favorite game characters got his spotlight from this one game. Oh, okay. We'll have to check this one out. All right. 
Slow build up. Dude, high key. Is this the game where Richter Belmont comes into play? Are we rocking like Castlevania, uh, like Super Castlevania 4? Or maybe it's Castlevania Symphony of the Night again. You know what? I'm going to go with that because why not? Let's run it. What do we got? No, it is not that. It is Devil May Cry 3. Whoa. I was not expecting a Devil May Cry game to show up on here at all, but hey, good for you. Cause this was one of my first Nintendo games and I just chose a track from it. Simple enough. Oh, uh, oh it's like a bonus room. Oh, it's a bon It's like a bonus room, like the Toad House from like Super Mario. I think it's like from Super Mario like World, but maybe the uh, GBA version. It sounds a lot like it though. Or like from Super Mario Bros. 3, I think. No, it's got a little bit more of a more remix to it, though. I think I'm going to keep it, though. I think I'm going to keep like Super Mario Bros. Uh, 3, the GBA version. Let's see. Let's see. Was it? Oh, I should have gone. I wasn't thinking that, but I, oh, I should have gone to Super Mario Bros. DS. A great song from a great game. Let's give it a listen. I was hoping we would get another Tropical Free song in here, but this doesn't sound like it. Wait, it might be. Might just be a Donkey Kong Country game. I'm going Donkey Kong Country 2. Diddy Kong's Quest. <sighs> what part of the game though? Like the final world theme is what I'm gonna go with. Here we go. Oh, woo! Bro, I got the game right. DKC2, Diddy Kong's Quest. That's two points right there. Let's go. I have this game. I don't play as much as other Switch games, but it's a good one. And the theme is really quirky or goofy and makes me happy if I'm completely honest. Okay. Who makes those sounds? Oh my lord, I can't even think right now. What what could it be? It's like it some of it gives off Animal Crossing vibes. It gives off gives off like I mean, oh man, it kind of gives off Pikmin, but not really. Who makes those sounds? Why can't I think wow, hang on. Uh I might just go New Horizons. I don't know what else it could be. Oh Big Brain Academy? I would not have gotten that one. Wow, that's a good one. Great opening theme to an underrated game. All right. Well, if it's underrated, that means I have a less of a chance of getting it, but I'm gonna still try my best anyway. What we got? I heard Dag and Rampa like muddled right before the title. Okay. Oh, which one though? I'm gonna guess the original. Danganronpa one, like title theme. Come on. Oh, I'm so glad I paid attention and I listened. Woo! You probably heard a remix of this. Here is another remix of it that is very good. Oof. Okay, these remixes are very tricky for me to get, but you know what? I'm still gonna listen to it anyway. Another like Smash Ultimate remix we're working with here. Oh, I've heard of this. I've heard of this theme, like the over the theme before. But what game? Oh, the remix makes it so hard. It, it could be Fire Emblem and it could be Xenoblade. Dude, I'm guessing Gar Planes from Xenoblade, but it's a remix. Give it to me. What do we got? Oh no, I should have guessed uh, Fire Emblem Engage. Did I say Echoes like a while before? I meant Engage, but whoops. I don't know if you'll get this one, but it's one of the most nostalgic and calming tracks I can think of. Game still holds up today. And if you've never played it, I highly suggest playing it as well as others in this series. Okay, this one's gonna be tough for me to guess, but I'm down to listen to it. Wow, very serene, very calm, like heavenly. Yeah, there's no shot I'm getting this. Uh, what could it be? If we're talking game still holds up, like what are we thinking? Like Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles. Let's give it a shot. Come on now. No, this is Halo 2. Oh, I never would have gotten this one. Wow, I was way off. I was, Dude, the calmness of it threw me off. I would never associate Halo with something calm. My favorite track from a game from my childhood that I barely see anyone talk about. Okay. What are we working with here? From your childhood, huh? Could be like GameCube N64, Wii Days, maybe? It's calm. You know what? Harvest Moon 64, because that just showed up on Switch Online. Let's give it a shot. Come on now. No! 
drawn to life? That's a deep cut. I'm not going to get that. Oh, my Lord. To me, this is the best song on this RPG series. Okay, I got to be thinking RPGs now. I got to be thinking RPGs. I swear, if it's another Paper Mario song, I'm going to flip. Oh. This has to be Final Fantasy. But Final Fantasy is such an expansive RPG. All right, I'm giving it another shot. Final Fantasy VII Remake. Nah, I can't be. No, hang on. Nah. Nah, not after that. Oh, my Lord. Dude, I'm thrown off. Oh. It could just be another Final Fantasy game. Like, what if it's Final Fantasy, like, 14? What if it's, like, Final Fantasy 14 online? You know, it's just another. Okay, these little sound effects still throw me off. I'm sticking with Final Fantasy. Screw it. What do we got? Mm. I swear to God, I think, I think, I think Paper Mario and Final Fantasy just need to swap their soundtracks because they sound exactly this. For some reason, the music in this series is quite the vibe. And although this is a song from the more obscure games in the series, I still think it's one of the best songs that this series has to offer. Okay, leaving subtle hints, but let's see if I can pick up on any of them. Dude, are we thinking Splatoon maybe? Okay. No, this isn't Splatoon. Oh man, but now it's in my head. Dude, I'm going like Metroid Dread, like options menu. Let's see. Do we really just get another FNAF World song here? I should have expected this. Simply, this just says a great OST. That's all the information I need. Oh, I've heard this before. Shoot, from where? Where have I heard this? Oh my lord, I've heard this before. Is this? Oh, hang on. Is this Yoshi's Woolly World? I think this is. This has to be. Oh, I think this is. Um, I'm going Curtain Falls. Is this Curtain Falls Yoshi's Woolly? No! Oh no, I thought this was Yoshi's Woolly World. I didn't think this was Tropical Freeze. Ah, oh, and I wanted more Tropical Freeze music as well. This is an obscure but fun little soundtrack that gets you in the mood for some gaming. Okay, I, hopefully it's still a gaming song, but let's give it a listen. Okay. Oh, low key. All right, I'm throwing a weird one out there, but I'm thinking this is kind of like, like the mini boss theme from like a Mario Party 6. Run it, let's run it. Oh, I was so close. Oh, I was so close. All right, I'm giving myself a point for the franchise. I knew it was Mario Party, but Mario Party DS? Oh my Lord. This is a theme that creates terror to every player on this game. If you know, you know. If not, there's a hint. Listening to this means you're screwed. Okay, good to know. Okay, this is definitely FNAF, like 100%. Because it's not gonna sound this cherry and not be FNAF. Uh, we rocking. All right, we're rocking. Like, yeah. Okay, now it's starting to get creepier. Okay, this is nightmare fuel. Let's go security breach. Uh, I, I guess I don't know. Like, time's up theme or something like that. Like, that's where I'm rolling. Security breach, please. No. Wow. It's not FNAF. Oh, it's from the new game, Lethal Company. Oh. Last time I put a song that you couldn't guess, but today isn't the day I ease. Oh boy. <laughs> I chose this song for you in order to show you there's more than just Monster Cat and copyright free music over there. And hey, you might actually end up enjoying this song. Okay. So I have zero clue. Oh, dude, Loki, we're going Street Fighter 2 Turbo, menu theme. I think it's possible. I'm sorry, what? What is, what is item aside? Okay, not even gonna worry about it. They did not need to go this hard for the very first level of this game, but it sure sets the right mood for the absolute madness you're about to get into. Good to know. Okay, no idea what I think this could be. No idea. A little guitar there. This is the first level. All right, I'm going. Uh, I'm going. I'm going. Uh, let's go. Dude, I'm rocking. Let's rock. Let's rock Sonic Mania. I'm gonna go Sonic Mania. I don't know. It could be a Sonic game. Let me. Let's see. Oh, I'm 
I've never heard of this game before. I might have. It's called Vampire Survivors. Whoa, okay, that's a deep cut. Nice. I hope it counts. I love this song and game so much. I've played hours in this game and the music is so good. Okay, well, hopefully it is a game soundtrack, but let's give it a listen. Okay. Final boss theme-ish. Dude, I don't know. Uh, dude, I'm gonna rock. Let's rock like... Oh, hang on. Let's rock like God of War, but like the original God of War. Maybe like God of War 3. Like the main theme. Let's see. I, I, I was in the ballpark. I was in the ballpark relatively. Elden Ring. Whoa! I chose this because there's this one YouTuber I watch a lot and he uses it a lot in his videos. I find it really peaceful. All right, hopefully I can decipher this one. Oh, yes, hang on. Oh, uh, Yoshi's Island stage uh, from Super Smash Bros. 64, I think. Or is it the one from Melee? I'm sticking with 64, give it to me. Okay, kinda, kinda, hang on. Okay, Yoshi Story 64 Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Give me, give me two points. A sleeper hit, simple and obscure. Okay, let's see if I can obscure this one out of my mind, maybe, I don't know. This is obscure, all right? Come on, any sort of drop? Nope, we're still keeping the calmness. I'm gonna go Secret of Mana. Credits theme. Let's run it. What do we got? No. Uh, okay. It's This is a game called Hearts of Iron 4. Wow. This song goes so hard for absolutely no reason. The game that it's from is a very underrated game. Oh boy. That does not at all feel like it needs this song when you look at the game. All right. Well, I'll just try my best to see if I can get it. Okay. It's not supposed to fit the game. I think it's a Sonic game. All right. We're going... Okay, wow. Uh, we're going Sonic Mania Final Boss. Here we go. What is it? What is it? What is it? Oh, I was a couple guesses off when I was talking about Wooly World. Oh my lord, it's been a minute since I've heard this one. This track is super nostalgic for me. Memories of playing this in the basement with my little brothers watching. It's a very chill tune and super listenable. Okay, I like this. Maybe we'll send off on a nice chill tune. Let's see how it goes. Okay, I'm not gonna get this. Oh man, I don't, I don't know. I really have no idea what this could be. I'm gonna guess Legend of Zelda, Majora's Mask, Overworld-ish theme, something like that. What do we got? Oh, it's another. <laughs> oh, it's another. It's another Paper Mario game. Oh my lord, dude, the Paper Mario ones have been annihilating me. Whoa. That's all the songs that I was able to find that you guys commented. Those are all the ones I listened to. This is my score. Let me know how you guys did. I'd love to know. You guys probably did a lot better than me. I'm not very great with identifying video game music, but I want to see your guys' score. Let me know how you did. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you to my members for being so extra supportive of this channel. You guys truly mean the world to me and they're helping me make this dream come true. So I really appreciate all of you guys, my members. Thank you for being so supportive and thank all of you guys for watching. Subscribe if you are new. Stay all pro and I'm out of here.